What's going on everybody? This is Joe and I am back with more Hearthstone. As I've been doing for the past few weeks while I wait for more solo adventures, I've been opening packs. And so I'm going to continue to do so. I have two more videos worth here. Uh, and then if there are not more solo adventures, I may have other things to do, not necessarily in Hearthstone, uh, for this time slot for the coming weeks. But definitely stay tuned. You can subscribe and ring the bell. Don't forget. Um, and I'm going to go with these this time. Let's see what we can do. Okay. So, four and a rare. Rafam's Scheme for the Warlock. Bronze Herald for the Paladin. Mutate for the Shaman. Soldier of Fortune for all classes. That's a sick art on this card. It's so good. And a Sweeping Strikes as our rare for the Warrior. Okay. We're going to do all 20 of these today, if that wasn't clear. And then, like I said, we can do all 20 of those next time. Two rares. All right. Magic Dark Frog for the Mage. Marked Shot for the Hunter. And Soul of the Murloc for the Shaman. A lot more, um, at least so far, a lot more class-specific cards. We have Underbelly Ooze for all classes. So, of course, it's going to be all classes since I just said that. And Warrior, and we got Dalaran Shaman Collector and Mage Collector. Okay. Um, summon two copies of a mini in your deck for 10 mana. Like, of our choice or random? Because if it's... I assume it's random based on the way that that's worded, but that that's possibly not that good. Okay. So... Ooh, okay. We got a legendary and a rare. Dr. Boom's Scheme. All right, so we have Rafam's Scheme. Now we have Dr. Boom's. Ursatron and Eccentric Scribe are rare. Is Togwaggle's Scheme. Lots of schemes. I like it, I like it. <clears throat> and finally, Lucent Bark. Eight mana, four, eight, taunt, death rattle, go dormant. Restore five health to awaken this minion. That's it? That's pretty sweet for a druid. I like that. Okay. Yeah, that's really sweet legendary. I mean, of course, it's a legendary, but really nice. Okay. Oh, two rares. Very nice. Arcane Servant. Hench Clan Burglar, which is a pirate for the rogue. And Spellbook Binder for all classes. Look at that dude's face. Amazing. Our first rare is the Forest's Aid for the Druid. Eight mana, twin spell, summon five tutus. And their treants, which is relevant for the Druid as well. Underbelly Fence. We got the Dalaran Rogue Collector. Underbelly Fence for the Rogue. Okay. Pretty cool. Ooh, an epic and two rares. These packs are working very nicely for us. Faceless Rager and Lightforge Blessing for the Paladin. Tunnel Blaster for all classes. A seven mana, three, seven. Death Rattle deal three to all minions. Okay, with Taunt. Spell Ward Jeweler. Three mana, three, four. Battle Cry, your hero can't be targeted by spells or hero powers until your next turn. All right, not bad. And our epic is Witch's Brew, two mana, restore four health, repeatable this turn for the Shaman. Not bad. Um, I've had this card in my hand before where, uh, in like solo adventures, where it's felt very bad. But um, assuming you can put it in a deck to make it work, that's pretty great. Hmm. Okay, four and a rare. Vicious Scraphound, Sun Reaver Spy, Arcane Servant again, and Traveling Healer. So again, now we have three for all classes, although god, I love that I love turtles. So this is really fun. Um and our rare. We got Dalaran Neutral Collector. Yeah, of course we did. Um Kirin Tor Tricaster. Four mana three three spell damage plus three. And our spells cost one more? Eh. Okay. Interesting for the mage. Four 
four and a rare again. Ursatron again. Hench Clan Hogsteed. Dalaran Librarian. Silence adjacent minions. What a what an amazing piece of flavor. God, I love that. And Violet Spell Sword. Gain plus one attack for each spell in your hand. Not bad for a 1-6 for a 4. I like that. You just put this in like a mage deck or something. And the rare. Imperno. What does so? What does EVIL stand for? Okay. Give your demons plus one attack. Give one damage to all... Or deal one damage to all enemy minions. How would you give one damage? Anyway. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh. Another epic and two rare. Amazing. Amazing packs this time. Walking Fountain. This is a sick one. Expensive, but worth it. Another eight mana. Eight mana, four, four. Taunt, battle cry, gain plus two, plus two for each other friendly minion. So this has the potential to be bad, but it also has the potential to be insanely good. Eager Underling. Look at that dude's face. I love it. Okay. A golden rare in Shimmerfly. What a nice golden to get, too, with this art. Very cool. And it's a one mana, one, one. Uh, death rattle add a random hunter spell to your hand what a and it's a beast as well just a very good versatile card and we got it in golden which is nice dollar on warlock collector and hunter collector um we got another witch's brew i don't love that that we have two of those i would have loved just some variants just to see what the other like some of the other options are in this um in this set but still I guess I, I'm not complaining about the epic, trust me. Ooh, legendary and a rare. Wow, wow. Okay, Hench Clan Sneak. Very nice. It's a quill bore. That's a particular type of uh, creature now. Interesting. Or minion, I mean. A golden common and crystal power for the druid. That's a cool art, too. I like that. And a magic dark frog, which means our rare is the underbelly fence again for the rogue and our legendary okay dalaran legendary collector nice keeper Stiladris. two mana two three for the druid after you cast a choose one spell add copies of both choices to your hand this is an insanely good card <clears throat> look we even literally have a choose one card in our hand or in our hand in this pack that uh, only costs one mana so that's fantastic. Really, really good. In fact, that said Restore 5 Health. So that even combos with the other Druid card that we opened um, that says Restore 5 Health to Awaken it from Dormant or whatever. So that's fantastic. Four and a rare. Bronze Herald for the Paladin. Nice uh, dragon. Sun Reaver Spy again. Marked Shot again. Toxfin. This art is so silly. That thing has a kind of a messed up jaw. And our rare is another Tyran Core Tricaster. Okay, we're halfway through these packs. We've been getting some sweet stuff so far. Four and a rare again. Hench Clan Sneak. Evil Genius, or E V I L Genius, which is fun. Hench Clan Burglar again. Burly Shovel Fist. Yeah, that looks like he's got a shovel on the back of his fists. A 9-man and 9-9 with Rush. That's pretty cool. Is this a kobold? It's got the, the um, candle on his head. Anyway, Portal Keeper, 4-mana, 5-2. Shuffle 3 portals into your deck when drawn. Summon a 2-2 two -two demon with Rush. Not bad. I don't love that this has 2 health, but it's only 4-mana. So for that ability, that's pretty sweet. <laughs> kind of sat there for a second being like, okay, what's next? But I, I have to actually drag the pack over. Okay, four and a rare. Aranazi Broodmother, six mana, four, six taunt. I like this when you draw this, restore four health to your hero. That's a great card. Evil Miscreant. A Flight Master as our golden common. See, like this one is not as cool of a uh, common to get in golden. Like those other two cards that we got um, had cool arts that like worked really nicely. This one's fine. I mean, it's a cool card, but... Um, Specifically, the art in Golden is nothing to, to write home about. Another Toxfin. And our rare is a Life Weaver for the Druid. Whenever you restore health, add a random Druid spell to your hand. Yeah, we got some sick Druid stuff today so far. At least that's what's like 
standing out to me the most is like all the all the cool synergies that all the druid cards give us. All right, four in a rare. Unsleeping Soul. That's great art too. I love those colors. Wow. Never Surrender. What a great name. Uh, one mana secret for the Paladin. Whenever when your opponent casts a spell, give your minions plus two health. Amazing. Evil Cable Rat. Sure. Improve Morale. Cool names. Deal one damage to a minion if it survives at a lackey, and it's a warrior card. We got Dalaran Neutral Collector. Dalaran Paladin Collector. Okay. And we got Sludge Slurper, which is a gross ass name, but cares more or er, does more lackey stuff. Interesting. Okay. Alright. Light Forged Blessing. Blessing of the Ancients. This is a great card. And, it, and of course it's for the Druid. I didn't even look. I should have remembered, but still. Another Blessing of the Ancients. Okay. Praise and you shall receive, I guess. Evil Genius. Again, cool name. And another Sludge Slurper. Gross. Gross, gross, gross. <laughs> okay. Four in a rare. All right, so they, they kind of front-loaded all the sick stuff, but I'm not complaining. We have another Aranasi Broodmother. We have another Never Surrender. Another Hench Clan Hogsteed. And an Evil Conscriptor. Okay, two mana, two, two for the Priest. Add a Lackey with Death Rattle. Or when Death Rattle. Portal Keeper again. Okay, we're getting a lot of duplicates, but I mean, like I said, we've opened some crazy stuff already, so... Four in a rare. Heroic Innkeeper again. Soul of the Murloc again. Mutate again. And Violet Spell Sword again. And our rare is another Underbelly Ooze. I didn't read this before. Seven mana, three, five for all classes. After this minion survives damage, summon a copy of it. I mean, it's seven mana, but if it lives long enough for you to be able to like attack with it and hit something small, or if you put it, it's all classes, so put it in like a warrior deck with, you know, pinging things. Like deal one plus two attack or whatever. Okay. Two rares and an epic again. Amazing. Vicious Scrap Hound. Burly Shovel Fist. A Spell Ward Jeweler again. A Mad Summoner. Six mana, four, four for all classes. Battlecry fill each player's board with one, one imps. Which, if your opponent has nothing on the field, this is actually pretty good for you. I guess they would just trade off, like, all their stuff for all your stuff. So, like, the Magical Christmas Land version of this card would be play this as your last creature or minion. Um, so your seventh when they have an empty board. So then you give them a bunch of 1-1s one against your board of presumably not 1-1s. One um, and they would be able to trade them all off, but they wouldn't. Um, it wouldn't be as effective for them. But anyway... That's a lot of work to make this work. Don't worry, I'm not advocating for it. Battlecry, give all dragons in your hand, plus three, plus three. I don't love that it's in your hand, but to be fair, I guess once you get to five mana, you're only just starting to be able to play dragons, typically. Um, but it's a five mana, three, five in addition to that, so that's pretty cool. All right, three packs to go. Let's do it. Okay, four in a rare. Dalaran Crusader. I love the, like the symbols, or the, like, you know, reiteration of the symbols. We've seen it a bunch in this opening. We have a Hench Clan Shade Quill with another Quill Bore, or as another Quill Bore. Another Rafam Scheme. Haven't seen that since the beginning. This art is amazing. I don't know why I didn't call that out earlier. Such a good piece of art. The, like, backlighting is awesome on that. On that. I really like it. And another Dalaran Crusader. And so, our rare is an Underbelly Angler. We got the Dalaran Priest Collector for the uh, Hench Clan Shade Quill that we opened. Uh, the Angler, two mana, two, three, after you play a Murloc, at a random Murloc. It's pretty good for the, you know, Murloc deck. <laughs> uh, rare. Four and a rare. So, Daring Escape, cool, fun art on this one. Return all friendly minions to your hand for one. It's the Rogue, so that makes sense. Uh, Evil Cable Rat, again. Violet Warden is a 6-mana 4-7 with taunt spell damage plus 1. That's pretty good. 
And another one. Okay. Rare. And our rare is Unleash the Beast. Six mana for the Hunter. Twin spell. Summon a 5-5 Wyvern with Rush. Really nice card. Okay. And our last pack of the day. Our last dollar on pack, it seems. Is... Just four and a rare. No complaints. We have a Mana Reservoir. Two mana, zero, six. Spell damage plus one. That's fun. And it's an elemental as well. Very interesting. Another Daring Escape. A Ray of Frost. Way to make us uh, wait for that one. That, that card's great. A Rapid Fire. One mana, twin spell, deal one damage. Okay, I could get behind that. And our final rare of the day is a Sun Reaver War Mage. A lot of um, unique cards. In fact, this is the only duplicate, and we only just opened it in like the last pack. Five mana, four, four. Uh, Battle Cry, if you're holding a spell that costs five or more, deal four damage. That's awesome. Okay. Well, hey, uh, next time I'm back with you opening packs, I'm going to open these 20, and then I'm going to be done. I, I started on this uh, a while ago, and had a lot of packs to open. It's it's kind of nice to be close to the end. It feels pretty good. Um, but as I said, I, I have a plan for what I'm going to do in this slot if and when uh, it takes a while for more Book of Heroes, Book of Mercenaries, or other solo adventures here on Hearthstone to come out. So definitely stay tuned to the channel. I may have mentioned this earlier, and if I didn't, I did a bad job. Um, please make sure to subscribe and ring that bell, and you'll get notifications whenever any of our videos come out, including the continuation of this series next week, um, or whatever Hearthstone I'm playing next week, whatever may happen between now and then. But also, don't forget, if you do ring that bell, you'll get notifications whenever we go live. Because on this channel, we are live every Monday and Friday from 8 to 10 p.m. Eastern Time right here on this channel. So Mondays we play MTG Arena live on stream with all of you in chat. Uh, and on Fridays we play random other video games um, where recently we have been playing through the Dragon Ball Z Budokai franchise from the PlayStation 2 era. Uh, and we've been doing pretty damn well, if I do say so myself. A uh, little bit of a humble brag, I guess, but not really. Um, but we've been having fun, which is really more that more of what matters. You're more than welcome. Come join us on stream. It's an absolute blast. We would love to have you. Um, any and all input, feedback, opinions that you might have on this video or anything in general, that's what the comment section down below is for. And I would love to hear from you. We, um, you know, if it requires uh, a response, we do read all the comments and stuff. So definitely talk to us in the comments. You can also check out our socials linked down in the description as well. Our other channels. We have video games for all where we had a lot of our original Hearthstone content, but now we've been doing a lot of other things. So check out the series over there as well that are playing out. We're doing some great stuff over there, namely, uh, to, to name a few, Ocarina of Time, as well as Pokemon Silver we're playing through. Um, and then we have uh, a bunch of different, more modern games uh, on our Sunday releases. So thank you so much for joining us. We really do appreciate it. And for now, from us here at the Geek for All family of channels, I have been Joe. And as we always say, in whichever video of ours you watch next, we will see you all next time. Thanks, everybody.